Alright everybody, welcome back! Okay. Now in the last couple of videos I had to go switch to the EPS EPSXE version 1.52 due to severe graphical problems. Now I've been able to switch back to 1.6. But the problem is, is that I now I had to turn on a bunch of off-screen filtering. I actually had to turn it up to the maximum level in the video, in the video options for the driver. Unfortunately, this is going to result in a lot of garbage, particularly before and after these battle cutscenes here. So. Unfortunately, we're just, gonna, we're just gonna have to live with it together. Yeah, see, what was happening was that I was getting what was called the, um... Apparently, what, it's called the Hall of Mirrors effect. It's basically where you see a bunch of shadows of... It's basically where you see all the frames of the animation has, has they occur. Like you see Barlow's sword and stuff going coming down at the top, the sky wasn't being redrawn or anything. So that was making things pretty much unplayable. And on the on the Let's Play forums I have to give a I have to say a big thank you to Vermil to Vermilion who who helped me troubleshoot this problem. So, Vermilion, I thank you very, very much. And once Faulkner goes down to half, less than half his hit points, he retreats from the battlefield. Coward. Should stay here and face his punishment for being, for being such a bad asshole. And Alden and Melior. Yeah, those sword, those swords you see, you probably haven't seen them yet. They're called the press shoes. In case you were wondering, or something. Okay, Reyna. Give this guy a, give this guy a stab from afar. Yeah, big deal. Actually, let's put Andrew right here so he can actually do something. Ah, excellent. He's gonna. He's, yeah, there's some of that garbage I was talking about. Ow! But yeah, that was. He was stupid because now he's dizzy. And now Zyra's gonna attempt to join Barlow and, and Devlin. Long distance tornado! For the win! Okay, Devlin. Time to make sure this guy knows where he's at. Okay, Bastion, let's see if we can't finish him off right here. Perfect. Huh. Hello. My, oh my, wasn't that fast. Yay, level up for Bastion. Sweet. Alright, might as well get his face up to 20. 13 plus the... Enhancements. Make 20. You need every stat at 20 for Bastion to learn his ultimate attack. Which is Soaring Dance. And we'll bait this guy over here with Andrew. Oh! I didn't expect him to be able to get him from behind. 
Oh well. Ow! Yeah, you actually touched me. Ah, uh, might as well just hit him from the front. No sense in moving for a while here. Oh, come on now. You seriously think, seriously think you're going to be able to do anything decent to me? You're not doing anything at all. You should be ashamed of yourself. All right, Andrew. Strong thrust this guy right into oblivion. Hey, soldier. Have you heard of, have you heard of the latest craze? Any tax armization with ninja, with ninja swords? Well, consider yourself initiated. Oops. There we go. Process, process. I'm surprised you- I'm surprised Zyra's not attacking him from behind. Aw, did it hurt, little boy? Yeah, I suppose I better... A simple thrust will take down more than half this guy's hit points. Gives you a, gives, just gives you a really good idea of how powerful Bastion really is now. Alright, Barlow, get in there and finish him. There we go. That's exactly what we want. Ah, <sighs> ah finally! Bailao earns himself a level. Very nice. Put his power up by one and his base up by two. Has he learned anything new? Eh, nothing important. And we'll set him up for Rayan to finish him off in the next turn. Let's finish this guy off with style. Pushing Pain! That was just awesome. Of course, Zyra will never make it to the battle in time, but good on him for trying. And Reyna will finish this battle off with one swift poke. And thus the battle ends. Try to ally with them, but fail. Come, my sex slave. And that will end this video, folks. When we come back, uh, we shall learn of the aftermath.